Are you a crossdresser or transgender woman who wants to look more feminine and attractive? Do you wonder what are the differences between feminine and masculine women? And how to enhance your feminine features and style? If so, this video is for you. In this video, we will explore the concepts of femininity and masculinity, and how they relate to your appearance, behavior, and identity. We will also share some practical tips and tricks on how to feminize your face, body, and wardrobe, as well as how to develop your personal style and confidence as a crossdresser or transgender woman. Let's get started. One of the first steps to looking more feminine and attractive is to determine your skin tone and choose your best colors. Your skin tone is the undertone of your skin, which can be warm, cool, or neutral. Your best colors are the colors that complement and enhance your skin tone, making you look radiant and healthy. Another important step to looking more feminine and attractive is to dress to flatter and feminize your body. Clothing can be a powerful way to create the illusion of female curves and balance your proportions. Here are some tips to help you achieve that. Make your shoulders appear smaller. Balance broad shoulders by wearing fuller pants and skirts. Opt for V-necklines, as they draw the eye towards the center of the body and create the illusion of a longer neck and a narrower shoulder frame. Avoid clothing items that have puffy sleeves, cap sleeves, or shoulder pads, as they tend to visually widen the shoulder area instead of reducing it. Make your waist appear smaller. Wear high-waisted bottoms, such as pants, skirts, or shorts. These create the illusion of a smaller waistline by elongating the legs and defining the waist. Wrap dresses are universally flattering and cinch in at the waist, creating the illusion of an hourglass figure. A well-placed belt can also do wonders for creating the illusion of a smaller waist. Wear a medium or thin belt at the narrowest part of your waist to help create a more defined waistline. Make your hips appear wider. Skirts with volume, such as a line or gathered skirts, can add width to the hips and create a more hourglass figure. Bottoms with embellishments, such as pockets, zippers, or patterns, can also add volume and create the illusion of wider hips. High-waisted pants or skirts can also create the illusion of wider hips by cinching in at the waist and flaring out at the hips. Your face is one of the most noticeable and expressive parts of your body, and it can make a big difference in your feminine appearance. However, you don't need to resort to surgery to feminize your face. There are many simple and effective ways to enhance your feminine features and disguise your masculine ones. Looking more feminine and attractive is not only about your physical appearance, but also about your personal style. Your style is a way of expressing your personality, your mood, and your identity. It is also a way of having fun and experimenting with different looks and pieces. Here are some tips on how to develop your personal style as a crossdresser or transgender woman. One of the best ways to find inspiration for your style is to look at other women who have a similar body type, skin tone, and hair color as you, and see what they wear and how they wear it. You can also look at celebrities, models, influencers, or anyone else who you admire and who has a style that resonates with you. You can use social media, magazines, blogs, or any other source to find inspiration for your style. You can also create a mood board or a collage of images that reflect your style and your aesthetic, and use it as a reference when you shop or dress up. Another way to develop your personal style is to experiment with different styles and pieces, and see what works for you and what doesn't. You can try different colors, patterns, fabrics, cuts, and accessories, and mix and match them to create different outfits. You can also try different styles, such as casual, chic, edgy, bohemian, or any other style that appeals to you. You can also try different themes, such as vintage, floral, nautical, or any other theme that suits your mood and your occasion. The key is to have fun and be creative, and to find your own signature style that makes you feel comfortable and confident. Accessories are a great way to add some flair and personality to your outfits, and to make them more feminine and attractive. Accessories can include jewelry, scarves, hats, sunglasses, belts, bags, shoes, or any other item that you can wear or carry to complement your outfit. Here are some tips on how to accessorize your outfits. Choose accessories that suit your face shape, your body type, and your personal style. For instance, if you have a round face, you can choose earrings that are long and dangling, as they will help to elongate your face and make it look more feminine. 
If you have a small bust, you can choose necklaces that are chunky and statement, as they will help to add some volume and interest to your chest area. If you have a feminine and girly style, you can choose accessories that are delicate and sparkly, as they will help to enhance your feminine charm. The final and most important step to looking more feminine and attractive is to boost your confidence and express your femininity. Confidence and femininity are not something that you can fake or force, but something that you can cultivate and embrace. Confidence and femininity are not dependent on your appearance, your style, or your gender, but on your attitude, your mindset, and your essence. Here are some tips on how to boost your confidence and express your femininity. Fear and self-doubt are natural and normal emotions that everyone experiences at some point in their lives. However, they can also hold you back from living your true and authentic self, and from expressing your femininity. To overcome fear and self-doubt, you need to acknowledge them, accept them, and challenge them. You need to acknowledge your fears and doubts, and understand where they come from and why they exist. You need to accept your fears and doubts, and realize that they are not a reflection of your reality or your worth. You need to challenge your fears and doubts, and prove them wrong by taking action and doing what you want to do, regardless of what others may think or say. You need to remember that you are not alone, and that there are many other crossdressers and transgender women who share your struggles and your dreams. You need to remember that you are beautiful, worthy, and powerful, and that you deserve to be happy and fulfilled. Feminine energy and power are not something that you can acquire or lose, but something that you already have and can unleash. Feminine energy and power are not weak or submissive, but strong and creative. Feminine energy and power are not passive or dependent, but active and independent. To embrace your feminine energy and power, you need to tap into your intuition, your emotions, and your creativity. You need to tap into your intuition, and listen to your inner voice and your gut feelings. You need to tap into your emotions, and express them freely and authentically. You need to tap into your creativity, and use it to create something that makes you happy and proud. You need to remember that you are not a victim, but a creator. You need to remember that you are not a follower, but a leader. You need to remember that you are not a man, but a woman. One of the best ways to boost your confidence and express your femininity is to connect with other crossdressers and transgender women who understand you, support you, and inspire you. You can connect with other crossdressers and transgender women online, through social media, forums, blogs, or websites. You can also connect with other crossdressers and transgender women offline, through local groups, events, or clubs. You can also connect with other crossdressers and transgender women personally, through friendships, relationships, or mentorships. By connecting with other crossdressers and transgender women, you can share your experiences, your challenges, and your achievements. You can also learn from their tips, their advice, and their stories. You can also have fun, laugh, and enjoy yourself with them. You can also feel a sense of belonging, acceptance, and love with them. Looking more feminine and attractive is not a goal, but a journey. It is not a destination, but a process. It is not a matter of changing yourself, but of discovering yourself. It is not a matter of conforming to standards, but of creating your own. It is not a matter of pleasing others, but of pleasing yourself. It is not a matter of being someone else, but of being yourself. We hope that this video has helped you to look more feminine and attractive, and to feel more confident and expressive as a crossdresser or transgender woman. We hope that you have learned some useful tips and tricks on how to feminize your face, body, and wardrobe, how to develop your personal style, and how to boost your confidence and express your femininity. We hope that you have enjoyed reading this video, and that you will apply what you have learned to your own life. Remember that you are beautiful, unique, and amazing, and that you deserve to be happy and fulfilled. Remember that you are not alone, and that you have a community of crossdressers and transgender women who are here for you. Remember that you are not a man, but a woman.